The serrations on knives are designed to counteract the natural twisting motion when you slice. On this standard right-handed knife, the serrations are on the left-hand side, which gives you a nice straight cut if you use it right-handed. When you use it in your left hand, it actually exacerbates the twisting motion. So you end up cutting your bread at an even more pronounced angle. This left-handed knife has the serration on the right-hand side of the blade. So now, it stops the twisting action and helps provide a good straight cut. The same principle applies to all serrated knives, from carving, slicing and food preparation ones right down to table steak knives. For left-handers who reverse their cutlery when eating, there's a left-handed steak knife that has a serration on the right of the blade, a left-handed fish knife that has the profile reversed, and there's even a unique left-handed spoon. A left-handed cake slice has a serration on the right-hand side so that you can cut slice and serve easily when held in the left hand. And a left-handed pastry fork has a thicker cutting edge on the bottom when held in the left hand. A standard right-handed tin opener is made to be held in the left hand on the tin with the right hand operating the handle. To do this left-handed you need to cross over and it's virtually impossible to turn because you're tied up in a knot. The answer is a fully reversed left-handed tin opener that has the blades the other way around can go on to the left hand side of the tin and be used with the left hand. Once you've opened your tin with your left handed tin opener the ideal thing for removing the remaining contents from the tin is a jar spin. This one's made left handed with a square corner and an extra long handle so you don't get messy. What you can do is scoop into your tin anti-clockwise left handed and scoop out the last contents from the tin. A standard right-handed corkscrew is made to be turned clockwise with the right hand. To turn it clockwise with the left hand is a very awkward motion, so quite often you'll see left-handers holding the corkscrew still and moving the bottle to make the corkscrew go into it. This is all solved by having a left-handed corkscrew which has the thread reversed so that it goes into the cork anti-clockwise and is nice and easy to turn with the left hand. The left-handed waiter's corkscrew is designed with an anti-clockwise thread to turn anti-clockwise with the left hand. It has a nice blade for cutting off foil, and then the thread goes into the cork anti-clockwise. You can turn that in nice and easy with your left hand. And we apply the edge and pull out the cork. If you use a single blade peeler, in your left hand, you're forced to peel away from you. Splattering the kitchen in shavings, giving you a lot less control and far more chance of taking the skin off your thumb. A left-handed peeler fits comfortably in the left palm and the blade is set so with the thumb resting on the potato or the fruit, you can pull the peeler towards your hand, making it much more comfortable and efficient to use. This citrus zester and decorator has the decorating blade set left-handed so that you can create citrus strips by pulling it towards you. It also has a zesting tool 